This video shows how to work on a calendar in the on-call scheduling application. An on-call calendar lists the shifts of a schedule. Here we're logged in as an agent. We can see a group's schedule using the group filter, including groups we don't belong to. Here's the database group's schedule. Here we can hide or show all rosters. We can also switch to a timeline view that's grouped by shift. To request time off, we click a shift, request time off, and then specify the dates and times. Note that an on-call shift time off differs from an HR time off. With a shift time off, an agent could still be at work. Your ServiceNow admin can enable or disable the request time off feature in group properties. Now we're logged in as a manager viewing the database group's schedule. Here we can see the shifts, the contact details for the agents on call, and the default escalation path for the schedule. We can also manage and edit shifts and edit spans. Now let's schedule time off for Angel Garcia. To do this, we'll choose Manage Shift Schedule time off and choose Angel. Next, we'll specify the dates and times. Here, he won't be available for the entire shift. Scheduling time off for Angel created a gap in the shift coverage because there's no one to cover for him. Now, let's add coverage. We'll go back to Manage Shift. Provide coverage is already selected. We'll select the roster Choose the agent to cover for Angel, and specify the start and end times. Now there are no gaps in coverage. For more information, see our product documentation or knowledge base, or ask a question in the ServiceNow community.